people wonder shall never end. Hey, hey, hey. You see, in this life, nothing is hidden under the sun. Even those ones you think they are secrets. One day, it will come to the limelight. My people, right now, they said, Kabiesi blows hot and prime stone on the families of the affected cats. <laughs> They said, Kabiesi have asked them, how did you know that it was Queen Naomi who put them in that situation? Hmm? How did you know? Then, if you know, what would they say that Queen Naomi have done to them for them to gather against her? Eh? And besides, Queen Naomi only prayed. She did not do anything to your family. She did not do anything to your fathers and your mothers. Go back to them. Ask them exactly what happened to them. That let this be the first and last any one of you will come to this palace to say, hey, Quinomi, please forgive, do that. Do. That Quinomi did not do anything to your people. Oh. Quinomi did not do anything. They should stop disturbing Quinomi. And right now, one thing he doesn't want for Quinomi is stress and disturbance of any type. Nobody should even bring it on because that person will not like it. <laughs> hey. They say families are trooping in. Because some of them don't they cry up from uh, among the 23 that is in the hospital, that was in the hospital. They say, be like, say one or two, don't cry. And these other people are afraid because they don't know what will happen next. They say they are trooping into the palace, begging Kabiesi to please speak to Queen Naomi. Please, Queen Naomi, forgive. Queen, Queen Naomi, forgive. See, had it been that we are able to defeat Queen Naomi, are they going to beg Queen Naomi to forgive? These people should know. They should know that they have messed with the wrong person. The second person asks one of them, how do you know that whatever that is happening to your father is coming from Queen Naomi? That person said that the father confessed in the hospital that they gathered to finish up Queen Naomi and Queen Naomi ended up finishing them. That it is her prayers that put them in that condition. That if only she will pray again for them to regain themselves, that they are going to be fine. Kabiasi said that. You are joking. You are joking. How do you mean? With Nami that is in, in her royal manner, enjoying herself, praying, doing her prayers. How? How? Is, is, you guys, this, this story is not clear. Say it well as God ask your father what happens to, uh, to him. Because it cannot be Queen Naomi. Queen Naomi cannot be in the royal manor and be in your compound. Besides, you are not even living in the palace. What is the problem? That said, Kabiesi, you understand what we are saying? Kabiesi said, I do not understand anything. Because there is no how you will say that what is happening to your father is from Queen Naomi. Hmm? Queen Naomi did not even know your father. Did Queen Naomi know your father? They say, hey, spiritually, she knows him. That uh, she ha he has been fighting her. This and that. But... Yeah, Kabiesi said that enough is enough. Let this be the first and last you people will involve Queen Naomi in any of your mess. That you should go and take care of your family. If anyone is sick, take the person to the hospital. Let the do do doctors and nurses do what they need to do, that they are going to get themselves. But if any one of them should open their mouth again and say, Queen Naomi this, Queen Naomi that, that he is going to take it up from there and deal with that person. Yet, Kabiesi was saying all of that. They said they were still begging. They were still crying, begging. After that set, another set will come. And tell Kabiesi, please, oh. Kabiesi, speak to Queen Naomi. Kabiesi, this, Kabiesi, that. At some point, they said one of them met Queen Naomi while she was going out. And Queen Naomi told her that, look, oh, I do not know what you are talking about. They said they were busy begging Queen Naomi, please forgive. Please forgive. Queen Naomi said, forgive you for what? What did you do against me? If there's anyone to ask for forgiveness of sins, it's God and not me. It's only God that forgives sins. It's only God that you can offend. You did not even offend me. Who are you? I don't even know you. Have we met? <laughs> Queen Naomi don't show them pepe. She don't show them say, power pass power. Whether they like it or not. Power do what? Pass power. The power of God is more powerful than all their powers. And that is what God has proven using Queen Naomi. My question is, had they been they succeeded, are their family members come and tell, are they coming to tell, are they going to come and tell Kabiesi that Luko, what happens to your wife is coming from my father and my mother? Eh? Are they going to tell Kabiesi no? No, they will say, maybe her God have taken her. <laughs> yes, so, because I don't know why, who, who only God knows how many of them that gathered there to fight when Naomi to finish. 
how many fast uh, sacrifices and rituals they must have done to come and gather to finish up with Naomi's Timaya. <laughs> but instead, God finished up their own Timaya. Reverse was the case. They said the same way the cats were born. That was how those people are suffering born in the various hospitals where they are struggling for their lives. <laughs> My people, one that shall never own though. Seriously, see this life. This life is millimeters. I don't know if you understand that language. This life is deep. <laughs> Let me use the word you will understand. This life is very, very deep. Yeah? The only level you know, that is where you know. You see this, this life. This life is bigger than what you know as a human being. No matter your age. Eh? There are a lot of things happening in this life that some people did not know. Many people did not know. You know, it's only the area that you are focused. You can say this is what is happening. But spiritually, a lot is happening. But one with God is majority. When you are with God Almighty, no matter what the come, no matter comes your way, no matter what comes your way, God is going to give you victory. And that is one of the advantage of being with God Almighty. When you serve a living God, when you trust in Him, when you make Him God over your life and your family. No matter where these forces are coming, God will always give you the power to overcome. God will always fight and give you victory. Seriously. Because one thing is certain. The Bible made it clear that surely they shall gather. But since their gathering is not of God, that they are going to scatter. All those cats, they scattered. They did not only scatter, they were born to buy. <laughs> and that is because Quinomi is in the right track. She is with the most high. <laughs> the one that wins a battle without fighting, that is who God is. The one that every other God bow to. Our God is indeed the most, the most superior, as in the most, oh God. I don't even know the right word to call God now. Because when he is doing most of the things that he is doing in our lives, eh, only then you will know that all these small, small gods that think they are powerful, <laughs> that is, they are powerful when God is just quite, uh, silent looking at them. By the time God said, hey, yeah, go and sit down, you will see them running helter skelter. <laughs> Those people, eh, if anybody have told them that, even with their numbers and their sacrifices and everything, that they are going to end up the way they ended up that night, they wouldn't have believed it. And that is because God is with Queen Naomi. So let them go and sort themselves out. That is what Kabias is telling them. That they should stop accusing Queen Naomi wrongly. That Queen Naomi did not do anything to them. Mm -hmm. Queen Naomi did not do anything to them. And if they think that Queen Naomi have done something, let them bring it on. That he is going to face them one by one. Don't forget that these are all alleged information, okay? Always bear that in mind. Give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel. Share my video. And don't forget that I love you guys. Bye. See you.